If you're starting out in photography and want to improve a little bit more, maybe you've bought a real camera, not just your iPhone or any smartphone, try not to listen too much to those professional and elder photographers who probably will tell you that if you don't shoot in manual mode, you're not a photographer. I've shot photos for some really big international brands and I use auto a lot of times. Uh, the cameras today are so intelligent and knows what scene you're taking that the auto mode is good enough. Sometimes I can use some overrides if I want to focus on speed, on the shutter speed or on the depth, but nine out of ten times I use auto. Yep, I said it. Another tip is trying to experiment a little bit with editing. Now I'm not talking about Photoshop or Lightroom, but your iPhone or whatever smartphone you have has some basic editing features. And that could be your highlights, your shadows, the mood of the colors, the contrast, uh, or just even crop it. It has a huge impact on your photography and can really make a big difference. Experiment by getting low, getting high, different angles, using the foreground to give some sort of framing not just to stand up, take the photo, and then you're done. But try to get low. I might go behind some rocks on the beach or in the forest, go behind a tree and just get a little bit of the tree in front of me to kind of blur something out or just to frame it and give it some sort of depth. You can have those wide shots where everything is in focus, but I personally like a bit of depth and that not everything is sharp. first. Get out, dress up, get out, shoot a lot of photos, practice, practice, practice. You can get some of the best shots in moody weather, like rain, snowstorm, if it's fog, it's just amazing. You just have to go out, practice, and even if you don't get some amazing photographs, you have learned something new. So get out, I promise you, you won't regret it. Done.